So can you tell me what's going on today? Uh, we're taking a look at the construction site, see how, the, how far along the building has gone. You're looking at the construction site today, so what are you looking for? We're looking at the materials and the heights and structures. Anything else? We're looking at the foundation and the strength of the materials of the building. Construction manager here at our high school site. Yeah, the superintendent. superintendent. And they're going to be talking with us about some of the things that you're seeing here. Right behind this white truck is where the new entrance to the school is. The left hand side is the elementary school, and the right hand side is the high school. So you'll be on the right side of the entrance, which is there's four stories. There's a lower level, which you can just see the top of, where the cafeteria is. And then you have classrooms on the first, second, and third floor. If you look at the columns, there's four, four columns on the, on the right side and five on the left side. So it's 25 feet wider on that side. Okay, let's, let's continue down this way. Sure. A little bit. You can see the lower level where these bottom windows are. That's where the cafeteria is. And as I said before, the first, second, and third floor are the classroom areas, and to the right is the gym. And we'll go down a little closer to the gym and get your shoes dirty. What is that? Fire okay. retention basin. When the storm water comes off of the building roof, it goes into the basin to let it evaporate before it goes into the city sewer to try and reduce the sewer load. Any questions? The architect um, company by the name of JQA was the uh, designer for the building. Basically, the architect puts everything down on paper. We get the we get the paper drawings, and then we have to uh, put this up based on those drawings. The unit required converting the unit from like what you said on the paper to you coming up there. Um, it's usually, it depends on how good of a job the architect does. If he does a very detailed job and gives you all the information you need, it's easy. Um, what side of the building? It's, well, each, each floor is, is uh, 13 feet 4. But the first floor is down in the ground. So if you're talking about from the basement slab all the way up to the roof, you're... Uh, about 50 feet high, but the ground levels up a little bit, so it ends up not being that high from the street. And then the grade changes as you go around the building. So it really depends on uh, what spot you're at as to how high it is. The grade will actually slope down along the front of the building. Being a perfect realist artist is just getting down on paper what you've seen today.